lot of trading going on right now. I'll get a little closer in. I'm gonna push you nice and close. Very well done. So here we go, Drake Buccaneer versus Mustang. So again, right, like the the power of the Mustang is actually pretty significant in terms of its thruster power. Like this thing can be really fast. So here we go, pulling in. See if he wants to fight, take a shot at him. Okay, he wants to fight. So here we go. Woo! Into a corkscrew. An S turn, back into a rate fight. Get my shields back up. Okay, corkscrew to shake any damage off. Get the shields back up, get the distance, back into weapons. Cut the turn. Corkscrew once you have incoming damage like that, right? Walk my way on target. There, I've got the distance I want now. I want to hold this position. There we go. Nice, nice, nice. Keep my shields up. Very smooth, very smooth. I really like the Mustang, man. Okay, let's talk today a little bit about reactions based on what my enemy is doing. What's the proper reaction in what situation? And we're going to look at something called trading. So in certain situations, let's say you're in the Buccaneer, you, it's really not in your best interest to force a reaction for a trade. And what I mean by that is you've got twice the gun power in the Buccaneer than the Mustang, and you've got more hit points, and you've got more shields. So you need to understand your strengths. The Mustang that we're using right here does not have more gun power, does not have more shields, and does not have the hit points. So how do we manage to get ourselves a win against the Buccaneer here? Well, I want you to pay close attention to what's going on in the left-hand monitor here, the left-hand MFD. I've received fire, boom, that's prompted a reaction to go into a corkscrew. I want to I level myself out now as I go for position. But the point I really want to drive home here is now that I've got dominant position because I've closed the distance, and again, right, we close distance with the corkscrew maneuver, okay? We don't use the corkscrew maneuver unless we're closing or separating distance. Bang, there's the kill. But I want to back up a little real quick here and show you the reaction that I want you guys to start training. This right here, when I'm getting fired at, I'm receiving damage, oh shit, into a corkscrew, up strafe hard, roll, push, push, push towards my opponent. I'm not really applying too much damage to him, but it's because I'm forcing myself into a better position. I want to get myself close because now that I have dominant position on the on the Buccaneer, he's a, he's lost the fight. I've got all this target time. Look how much target time I have before he even starts to start shooting at me. Okay, so this is something I want you guys to start training. I hope it's something that you can understand from this video. But what's what you want to do in the less armored, I guess less. Um, less thick ship is once you start receiving damage once you start to see oh shit i've got some sh some shield damage you want to force yourself to prompt that reaction if if that if anything it's going to waste their ammo and it's going to give yourself that little bit of extra time to get your shields back and win the fight i hope this content was useful for you folks i hope to see you all over stream please like share and subscribe if you feel like this content something that you enjoy and i hope to see you in the next video